topics to be covered so before like uh, then we can have a clear talk about it so like myself nanda kumar so i have around 9 years of experience in pro this qa testing like mostly all my experience in automation testing like almost 6.5 around automation and 2.5 in manual so yeah i was working with selenium java and then javascript protractor bdd como framework <clears throat> so i do hold experience on it so why i chose tosca to give a training like uh, because like it's currently booming in the market and uh, yeah uh, we need to go as per the trend because we need to update our knowledge as well so that's the reason i chose tosca and also i am doing cypress as well so, uh, like from udemy so i just want to be uh, currently trending in the market so that is the reason i just chose this course <clears throat> So any questions for me as of now? Mm-hmm. No, no. Okay. So this one, uh, I was doing some POCs on this Tosca and I have some knowledge about it. The thing is like, but I want to deep dive, in it, deep dive into it so that I can, if I go outside of this, uh, uh, the current company also, I just uh, need to crack the interviews and I need to be strong on this. So that is the reason I chose to have a session. otherwise i can do it in udemy also because like i i do want to deep dive in it so that is the reason i just i chose i chose this course and then uh, i do want to automate sap portal so that is my main agenda so because like uh, uh, this web ui portal anyone can automate but sap it's not that much easy to automate because identifying elements will be too difficult and that will be a challenging task i think raj might know that mm-hmm. okay <clears throat> so that is the main agenda for me if i mm-hmm. want to learn task in depth so i so that i can automate all the sap portals uh, whether it is a native app or it belongs to a web application as well so both i need to cover so that is a main agenda for me mm-hmm. okay okay so for the sap thing do i have any license or any sample applications no uh, I, yeah i have applications because like in my current company i have a sap portal Where mm-hmm. I was doing a POC, but uh, I was a little bit stuck about it. So mm-hmm. okay, so, so that, that, that you're yeah, connecting that... with your local machine, or like, will you be able to like share screen and do? Ah, uh, yeah, I can do it. Okay, then not an issue. We can like cover that as well. Yeah, so that 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 is the main reason that I want to do this course because ah mm-hmm. uh, I I came across many challenges, but this was a little bit interesting for me. Uh huh. and uh, yeah i need to crack it that is the reason that is the main agenda for me to do this mm-hmm. course okay mm-hmm. so any other uh, requirement like particular specification you are looking for so uh, apart from that everything you will be covering like from uh, beginner to intermediate or uh, to yeah that, that is fine that, so uh, i need like covering something on. like specific like sap as you mentioned right anything specific which you are expecting uh not about that because like everything can be possible That okay is my so, idea is like because like as i mm-hmm. do old experience in automation but i can do anything about it so main agenda mm-hmm. for me is like automating the sap portal <clears throat> mm-hmm. okay yeah. so let let me give an introduction about myself so i am a tosca certified uh, automation present is certified tosca automation architect and also certified trainer from the uh, present is and uh, like coming to the course details so i am i have trained more than like 3 people and then like coming to the course details so what we basically do is we provide you the license uh, for example like a whole tool will be installed in your local machine and then also we provide the license and all to practice and coming to the sessions so it will be all will be the live sessions so there won't be any recording sessions at all so once post the class is completed so we'll be getting the recording so for your reference and then practicing things and all so we'll be providing those recording post the class mm-hmm. and all the class will be the live and it will be a kind of a, a live example so for example if i am explaining a particular topic so what i do is i just pick up a particular uh, example which is related to that topic and just automate that thing or like scan the elements or like buffer the things and all and then showcase it on the go it it's not just like a theoretical how we do it it's all practical things and then coming to the topics we basically have uh, segregated our topics into uh, i hope you are able to see my screen right yeah i can able to okay yeah so we basically have segregated the topics into three sessions so one is like beginner and uh, other would be intermediate and then the advanced level so okay. in the beginner what we do is we basically start everything from the scratch 
so like it might be like creation of an workspace import yeah and also importing the standard modules and how to make use of this basic like identifying the properties so we go all from a scratch and then in the uh intermediate what we do is we uh deal with this as you mentioned sap api database and all so we yeah. cover those things in an intermediate and then also we cover this test case design section and the data handling and all and then when it comes to the advanced level so we uh yeah. showcase you how will be the multi-user workspace and uh, also how to make use of an excel as a template and also like setting up of a distributed execution and like configuring the agents and uh, also using the requirement section pdf scans and all so these all we cover in an advanced uh, level so apart from this if you have if you are encountering any uh challenges or like let's say if you have any additional application which you want to scan or like show you how exactly it works so even that will be taken up as on on the flow so this is what uh, pretty much we cover in our course okay perfect sounds good for me i'm not, mm -hmm. not an issue like yeah i think if if everything is covered properly then i can do i can mm -hmm. like i'll be a uh, expert on this like if i practice mm -hmm. well so mm -hmm. sounds good yeah, for me the we course. cover these topics so it would be like it also depends upon the application so for example uh the uh, the way of the approach which has worked for xyz application so the same approach would not work for the uh, other application uh, so at that time it would be just it would be the change of a uh, logic and things so you should okay. be just aware about all the concepts so that like uh, for example uh, x concept is not working so you should uh use the y approach and then yep. it would be just like uh so in that basis what we do is we cover all the topics whatever will be coming and then we have designed designed this course based upon the challenges which we would face in the uh real time so mm -hmm. those things we have captured and then like designed it oh, okay fine fine that's sure. so uh the next question for me is like so you you told me like you'll be covering uh gui api and then sap right all three so will yes, all yes. three have different frameworks? Uh, in Tosca, we don't have any particular framework. It's uh, totally, it's like how we design our uh, test cases. So instead of model-based testing, so we just create the modules. So it's like, for example, I have used this uh, uh, framework here. I want to like use this in other application. It won't work like that. For that's SAP, fine, we have some, uh, for SAP, we have some predefined modules, which are provided by the tri and yeah. And, uh, for the success factor and all, those are the additional packages. So, mm -hmm. which do we do not have. So, it's an additional package. It depends upon the companies. So, com some companies, what they do is, they just create the modules by themselves and then do it. But, like, some companies, what they do is, they just uh, take this uh, uh, this additional package from, it's basically a kind of, like, standard models what we have. So, yeah. we'll be getting some additional things from the uh, tri centers. Okay, so everything will be organized, right? So because like why I am asking these questions, like for freshers, mm -hmm. it is a different part because mm -hmm. it's for for them, it's mainly of a cracking of interview. That is a major thing mm -hmm. for them. But for mm -hmm. experience, mm -hmm. it's not like that, right? You mm -hmm. you, you may be aware of it because mm -hmm. like if, mm -hmm. uh, if an experienced candidate goes into Tosca, that obviously mm -hmm. he has to work in the project directly without any kind mm -hmm. of training or those kind of things. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I should be ready for it. That is the main goal. Yes, for yes, 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 yes. So the thing is, like, we cover all the topics. It would be like how you uh, practice the things and then mm -hmm. how you implement the things in the different scenarios. So what okay. we do is for the training purposes, we have some uh, basic websites and all, so which we will mm -hmm. be considering. So you yeah. can practice those topics. You can apply on your application, whatever you will be dealing with your like day-to-day -day activity. Mm -hmm. You can apply okay. those logics in your application and get back to me if you're facing any doubts or like facing any challenges. Uh, I'll be like much more happy to get clarified. Fine, fine, Rajshara. So uh, yeah. can you know about yourself, Rajshara? So you told about training and you're certified. So mm -hmm. what, what, mm -hmm. what, uh, what's the current uh, thing you are doing? Like are you a complete trainer or you're working somewhere? Yeah, see, we have like our organization. So we okay. just deal with uh, this project center. So we basically help to like set up the project as an initial stage. So what happens is in most of the companies, what they do is it's like very uh, uh, expensive for them to like get the trainer. Like for example, uh, if I take an example of eight to 10 year experienced guy. So it will be like very expensive for them to hire them and then like maintain the things. And also it's an, uh, what you can say, like paid version. So already they would be paying like a lot of amount for this license. Mm -hmm. and all. So what yeah. we basically do is 
we set up the things at an initial stage. So what okay. we do is, for example, once they got the project, so we set up the workspace and then uh, we create some reusable blocks and then mm -hmm. we do some hand holdings at the starting and then post that the uh, internal people, whatever the manual tester or like whatever people they have, so they will be taking it forward. So in those okay. kind of things we do. Okay, perfect. Sounds good for me. Yeah. And mm -hmm. one more thing is like, so for example, this uh, training is going to be held for 45 days, right? So once yeah, after yes. this training completes, so what and mm -hmm. all the support that you'll be giving for me? Uh, so support in the sense, you will be having all the recording videos. Uh, now and then I can just connect for like half an hour or that's it. No, 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 that, that's fine. That's completely fine for me. Thing is like, so for example, after 45 days, after the completion of this course, mm -hmm. so what, uh, think like I, I got into a task project and mm -hmm. uh, I'm facing some challenges over it. So mm -hmm. at the time, if I need help from you, so is it, is that support been uh, yeah, like one or two, like uh, one or two challenges. Like let's say if I can like uh, solve it over the chat, I can do it. But if you need a complete real time uh, support, then it would be a separate thing apart from this training. Ah, that's I, can, I completely agree. Uh, with that. Yeah, I have a people I can get assigned to one person for you, so he mm -hmm. can help you out. No, okay, it's not okay, an okay, issue. Okay. I have people for that as well. Okay, 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 got it. So it is after the course also. That's what I am asking because yes, 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 yes. We do in the like course. Anyone support. can help. Yes, yeah, yes, in yes, between yes. the course, yeah. I can get the support. But after the mm -hmm. course completion, after one or two months, if I get into yes, 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 yes. and then if I need a support from mm -hmm. you, so that is possible or not. That is what I need to Yeah, yeah not an issue. I have the people I can get your assent. So you can like take hourly support or even the monthly support. So based upon your requirements, you can just, uh, uh, I can get the people assigned to you, not an issue. Okay, okay, fine. So uh, with this course completion, Mm -hmm. So, can I able to crack automation specialist one and automation specialist two? Yes, 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 you will be. Yeah, okay. you will be got it, got it. Fine. Yeah. So, that's it. The, I think uh, I am I am clear about myself. And then, mm -hmm. is there anything you need to ask for me or any clarifications you need from me? Uh, no, I am. I am good. Okay. So, it, it will be a one to one, right? So, it will yes, be. Yes, it will be just like one to one. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. Uh, okay. uh, or it's okay. like. Uh, if possible, I'll be just adding like a couple more people, but mm -hmm. it will be hardly like two to three, like no uh, it will not be more than three people. <clears throat> no problem. Because uh, uh, what happens is like our most of our candidates, they're all like working profession. So mm -hmm. it's like okay. very difficult to like put them everyone at a one single time frame. Single time. So that is the thing. Yeah. So we just keep it like two to three maximum. Because what happens is even if, even if we increase like five to six people. So mm -hmm. what challenge we face was like, for example, each people are... are Coming up with an adult and a person on average, it's take like yeah. 15 minutes. So well, it's six obviously people, the it's session like will go in that. Yeah, whole <laughs> session will be went in, will be going in that as well. So that Solving is the oh, so okay, perfect. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think sure. yeah, that, that that would be a good idea because like adding two or three two or three people in a batch. Uh, I think mm -hmm. if I am having some doubts, like I can ask, and then if other mm -hmm. people have have some some questions about their project, they can mm -hmm. come to that. So we'll mm -hmm. get an idea, yeah. like how you are. Yes, yes, yes. Even it will, you, even for you, it will be a, uh, uh, like knowledge expansion kind of. Yeah, so you will be seeing the other uh, uh, challenges and all. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thanks, Perfect, thanks, Raj. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Sure. Thanks, Ganesh. I'll uh, call you Ganesh first. Uh, okay, okay, sure. So any questions? Yeah. Uh, no, Ganesh. I am good. I am good. Okay. Then. Uh, I'll keep a post right about the uh, sure. date and the timings and that sort of thing. I'll speak to Rabbi uh, Shlashek and confirm you. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, Ganesh. Yeah, fine. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Rashik. Thank you for your time.